Oh, there's so many things that I can do. Okay, well, there's not on here, so I'm gonna just do a super fast show because it's right here. Yeah, so just because you're know saying they, they know you black, don't stick yourself to one genre. You're like, well, she's gonna do rap too, I guess. Yeah. I wasn't going to do a song in the first place. I was going to do a poem, and it was going to be about death, but... That's your emo side. Yeah, I was going to let my emo side out. I'm about to kick your ass. Okay, all right, so I'm going to do Super Fast Do a Do a little pump song. I don't know any little pump songs, and I really Pumpsy don't want to go and venture on that. No, see, no. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. so finally got a song. I really thought that they said super fast <laughs> up in your ass. <laughs> you thought they said it. Yeah, because you see. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Oh my god, that's funny. I just want to make sure the stream is good. I think it's good. I think it's alright. I think it's straight. It's not oh, lagging. Yeah. Or anything like that of that nature. Because YouTube was tripping. This is why I don't like streaming on YouTube, because they always trip. Alright, let me see how to do it. So I can hurry up and do it. I'm not doing my. Oh, wait a minute. What's today? Do an excellent. Mm. That's a lot of sensory. Do the most darkest excellent. What's the darkest excellent? I don't know. Cause I don't listen to him. I don't listen to him like that to hear his darkest song. Darkest song would probably mm, it could be Wing Written Angel, but I haven't listened to a lot of his stuff yet still, so that's the only one that I know. Previously on The Walking Dead. Oh, oh. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. Now I'm gonna go look for more. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Oh, bullshit. Krista, run! <laughs> I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Hey. For all we know, she could be working with Harper. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Um, Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? 
Gone. You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Oh. How do I I'm find fine. the fucking? I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. He's making me a bitch. God damn it! Come this what way! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of you. Oh. Are you gonna help me with spider on the What? God damn it, Nick! We have to go. Supposed to want to shoot a fire you telling me? Well, I guess I got something to ask. People watching today. No, she not using Snapchat. Okay. Maybe I should stay away. Well, they shouldn't be able to get through no, no. that. On the downside, we can't get through them. Help! You're really making me upset. No! No! I'm not passing what fucking... Oh, alright. <laughs> Staring ain't polite. Come on out and say it. What have you attacked? What are you going to do? Where? Hand me that there. Are you sure? I got nothing to lose. Other than my fake awakeness, of course. Okay, here we go. Fuck it all. Bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just. Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. I got some water for him. You want some water? I ain't give it to the uh. The, yeah, he need some water. He need some water. <coughs> Anything in that? Not much. Here. Why did you Thanks. Take your time. I'll keep looking around. He fucked up out here. Okay. Out of gas. What? Of course. Okay. Of course that wouldn't work. I don't. This song is about the jelly. What's in there? <laughs> Anything we can use? Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now. But I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. You got a light? Tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? <sighs> we wait. The oxygen. I'm 
in your ass. Pick up that saw. Get ready to cut his shit. Pick up that saw. Yeah, nigga. Oh, hey, you good, oh, hey? You good? Let's get it, man. You already know. Free to God. <coughs> All them niggas in this and Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. Somebody's still man. You wanna hear something funny? That's me. Yeah. I've been thinking. And I don't wanna die. <coughs> <laughs> Say something like that, but there it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. You're going to be That's okay. Bullshit. Oh, at least spare me the bedside bullshit. Sorry. Would you? Would you promise me you'll watch out for me? I Nick? know what to say. His time was running. I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think. He yeah. is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Why Thank you. you Becky. Been almost a day. They ain't gonna find us. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where are you going? Hold up. I'm not getting out of this. Shit. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? Wait for my signal. And straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. Oh, wait. This is just all from the fire. Let's get this over with. Ooh. Oh, no, no, no. That's not this cool. Summarize the poem in your own words. Wow. Ooh. Fuck up! <laughs> Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walkers. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. All right. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. 
Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. I think that's when that uh, Carver nigga gonna show up. Say cheese! I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Book me for a show. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Sorry, I, I, I just need to. She called me Bay. That's the stupidest shit she could say. Yeah, Chevrolet. Race. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? I just... It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Don't do that! S sorry sorry maybe i could practice outside there's that tree hey luke's back Where the fuck did she go? That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. <laughs> Find somewhere to hide. Where? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. Hello. Where are you? Anybody home? Thank you. Just over some my family and I have set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? But before show, I begged him with Chase. Clementine. Clementine. Well, you look just like Clementine. She told me she gave wonder and her brain yesterday. You mind if I come in, Clementine? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. We have a big she group told me of she gave mother and oh, her friend yesterday. How big? Dozens. They'll be back soon. And they left you here all alone. They must trust you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I uh. they might have gotten lost. Maybe ah. I've seen him. A couple of farm boys and an old man. A Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. 
a bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Well, looks like a damn tornado ran through here. Must be like close to ten people with you? More. Hmm. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Just passing through. Going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. Have you been north? Well, not since before, but I've heard things. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. It's a real nice place, kind of cozy. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. I miss him. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite for a little girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. This is my house. Fair point. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything. This bitch caught me bay. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. But I came in for a place and didn't, didn't mean to be rude. Even race. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Who's this? Well, it's a kid. Yeah, looks like it was taken in this room. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met him, how much did they trust you? Well, they locked me up in a shed. If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back?
we need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. Amelia's here. What? What did she say? Someone came <laughs> to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? Why do you care so much? Excuse me? Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know. Kind of deep and scratchy. <coughs> he talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why oh he's not gonna do word. anything crazy oh or word. not nice. Right? I don't know. You man. know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say know. anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an I'm idiot? Like I thought we were friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. They don't want you to eat Cheetos. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Now, you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. <laughs> yeah, bitch, you better just apologize. A little bitch. I still don't like what you did. Sneaking around on us and taking advantage of my husband. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? Really call me Bay. Stupid as she should say. There. That's where we were. Well, I came in the first place and he even race. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Uh, 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 oh, oh, oh. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Little shoulder lean, shoulder lean. Pete! Hey! 
Uncle Pete! Oh my god. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. Thanks. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. You gotta get moving. Come on, man. Tell me, tell me how it happened. He was scared and... Scared? My uncle? He got bit. Back, back in the stream. Fuck you. No way. Nick, come on, man. Fuck off. So this is not about breakfast. Oh. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us... We should be able to lose him up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Boy, you are ugly, boy! But I came in first place. Crazy. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Here, eat this back. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Hey, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on.
Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gangs. Now, what do you think they're all after? Food. Nope. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? I give up. Come on. Clem, it's family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. But there are only two. Well, what do you think? I think we can take them. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. I wish we could use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. <laughs> nice work, kid. <laughs> Ow. phone. I bring a load of shit.
Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. You see him? Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. What should I say? I don't know. Ask him for directions. Who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. We're a little lost. Lost, huh? Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? <laughs> what the fuck? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You're the one holding a gun. Touche. You folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Why do you care where we're going? It's sort of my business, considering I live here. You live here? Yep. You're in my backyard. I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Stop! <laughs> this dumbass nigga. Remember that happening. Yo, this nigga's stupid as shit. Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why did you shoot? He pointed a gun at me. Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Remember that fucking part. I really don't like this nigga now. <laughs> Who the fuck? I don't remember that. What's that I don't man? remember that happening. I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That I remember them being on a bridge and talking to, to somebody, but I don't remember oh, uh, was he? Nick coming out of nowhere and shooting niggas first. and shit. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Everybody calm down. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy gonna shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't... Don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex is dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. 
Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. Thanks, Clem. I don't even want to say nothing to Nick. Don't look at me. You fucking asshole. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Feels pretty good. You need to keep that shit. Ain't nothing else to look around at. Can I use the knife to open this shit? Yeah. I thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He's out of control. That's what I'm saying. He keeps on like that, he's going to get one of us killed. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? I don't want to talk about it. That's funny. She looks just like you. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. <laughs> Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You, you feel like taking a look? That'd be just like climbing a treehouse. Yeah, just a, a really tall treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. That sounds stupid. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down. Just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. Made it. You see anything? I can see the bridge. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. W wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? I... I thought you were dead. I'll take that as a yes. Are these people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please come in. Right? Like as soon as he said, you know this, you know these people. <laughs> she could have turned around like, I don't fucking know these people. <laughs> I would have been grimy as shit. Lee. How the fuck would she go save Lee? Nigga a zombie. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. She did. Walter see here's one smart son from being his own. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm Us. good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. Dad, look! A Christmas tree! Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. I don't fuck with Kenny like that neither. Be honest. I, I never really fucked with him all like that. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep.
Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? I don't really want to talk about him. Oh, hell. I'm sorry, darling. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid... well... Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand, and then it got messier. For a minute there, it wasn't looking too good for old Kenny. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. It's a long story. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you've used that to your advantage. Sometimes. Smart girl. Mmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. Huh. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. He didn't turn the stove off. What you got to say about this game? Because a lot of the fuck people keep saying it looks like it. Well, she ain't say nothing. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. Put that new Kendrick Lamar album in that radio. Reminds me of school. Mm -hmm. 
Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. So, how'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up? You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? You can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. They could be hiding something. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. I don't want to talk to her. Alright, so what are we going to do? The angel, the star, the next one. do the angel. Because, uh, what's the name? Tell me, we always put an angel on our tree. So she might get an attitude. So we put something else other than that. She looks so cool. Yeah, yeah, she remembers. Beautiful. It. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. I haven't noticed. Oh, well, let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll oh, tell you... Getting aggressive, I like... This. Couldn't lift a fly. <laughs> Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Where the fuck did Kenny go? I can't go that way. I didn't want to go back upstairs. Oh, here we go. Another part. What's this? I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map, I'm the map.
Ain't nobody else to talk to. I guess I gotta talk to Rebecca. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. I don't know. Yeah, that makes two of us. I know it's gonna be hard, but at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You wanna listen? That food smells good, huh? It's okay. Can I? She's gonna be a runner. If he finds out it's not his, they'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. I... I wouldn't say anything. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is oh, served. I did to talk Come to on, her. They gonna make me choose who the fuck I want to sit with. Like it's fucking. You okay, man? School or some shit. Yeah, just. I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. <laughs> What's up, Luke? I'm fucking kidding you like that. So what's the deal with your friend here? Yes, we were just talking about this Kenny. What do you make of him, Clem? Well, it's been a while, but he seems a little different. Yeah, well, that happens. I mean, guy could have seen all kinds of shit. No sense jumping to conclusions. Walter was telling me his family died. That's horrible. Thing like that can hit a guy pretty hard. He lost his whole family? Wife and kid. He lost it a little after that. Lost it half? Well, he drinks. Oh. Well. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> so, it's Luke... That shit wasn't even funny. ...and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winner? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. What kind of place? A good one, Einstein. I don't know much about it. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Oh, man. Jokes. Michigan? <laughs> you got Fucking a hearing problem, kid? Shrek yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land. Right around and all this winter, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what your deal oh, is, but you're more than life. welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now, look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. 
Duck? Who's Duck? Duck was his son. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher. And I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. We're gonna leave in the morning. No, no, you gotta stay. We have to keep moving. Clementine, in this world you don't have to do anything. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? I have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? It's never that easy. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. It's nothing. Forget it. Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one no advantage wonder. of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back like before this storm too. hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you, then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. I have a little girl like you. How old are you, sweetie? I... I don't know. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Freak out. Shit, Cricket, what the fuck is y'all talking about? <laughs> Listen, okay, I, 
gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Oh, shit. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. What if he finds out anyway? Well, then we're fucked. But, you know, we'll just... We'll just deal with it then. Now, do you, uh... You still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh... Keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh... There's nothing, man. I just wanted to... Check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? No, we should fucking tell <laughs> yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, something like that. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. Don't tell him what the fuck he did, because he a dickhead. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? Either way is risky. Exactly. Jesus. I sniff I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Well, I definitely did have to, you know what I'm saying, tell him what he did just now. That shit gone. It's gone. I bounce back with a juice box and shit happened. Shit happened. Bounce back with the apple juice box. Are you okay? I always liked this knife. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now? We didn't do anything. Where'd you get the knife then? We found it in the shack. Is, uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? Is he just one of those, uh, those fuckers who don't give a shit about anyone but themselves? <laughs> he was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to get out of here. This world is hell. People like Matthew aren't coming back. This is it, and now he's gone! What did you do? Did you hurt him? Did you hurt Matthew?
didn't do anything. All right? gonna draw walkers we gotta shut it down now hey help me carry the guns guns that thing's a damn dinner bell know how to do this? Wait. I can do it. Okay. We'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Simple as hell. You telling me none, none of them could fucking do that shit? Something ain't right. Yeah. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us! I played this the first time, I don't remember Nick dying right away like this. Where's Nick? I don't know. You didn't 
didn't see him. Clem. Walker's got him. Clem, get inside. Go. I think it's because I lied to him. I think that's why. I think I think that's why. But last time I played this, I don't remember. I don't remember Nick dying like that. <laughs> Remember, uh, what's the name? He's he looking at me, and then he shot the zombie and saved him. That's what I remember. That's what I remember having. What a crackhead, bitch, y'all. Howdy, folks. <laughs> she do look like a crackhead, though. <laughs> <Where's the pickup? laughs> Carver. That's just trifling as hell. It's nice to see you too. And now he deserved to get punched in the face, nigga. You spinning somebody's face, nigga? Oh no, no, you you doing too much. Inside. That's the most trifling shit ever to do to a person to spit in their fucking face. It's you. Keep moving. Look at this place. Leave this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. Oh. And Alvin, Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice. And show your faces. Please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. We start shooting and people are gonna die on both sides. Clem can sneak out. Find Lou. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Snap! Literally, he's snapping his fucking finger back like a motherfucker. We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. 
You don't know that. I'll find Luke and Kenny. Stay here. God damn it. You never did listen. Hurry! Let's see if I can get your attention. Ah! Push her down the steps to cause a distraction. What the fuck? So y'all know it's Kenny Fall. Walt! Oh my god. <laughs> That's for our man. Now I didn't want to do this. But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. He's still shooting. And he's still shooting. the kid clam don't shoot what he'll kill him we can't just give up Kenny he'll keep doing this think about Sarita we're coming out let's go Where's Luke? Finally, you can think he a fucking Why am I MLG surprised? fucking marksman. I warned you. Quick scoper and I shit. I warned you like, not to follow him. <laughs> this nigga. <laughs> Look where he's led you. Big out. Oh, shit. Uh, this is gonna be a sloppy Let's shot. Say, I think I can get him. No. We're going. No, home. the kid. You can't. As a family. <laughs> All right, round him up. We're heading back to camp. Like, fuck wrong with him, like, yeah, yeah, Kenny Trippman, like, 
Yo, he be tripping throughout this whole fucking season. Like, I don't fuck with him because of this season. Son of a bitch would have shot Walt no matter what we did. Well, I ain't going out like that. Not without a fight. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what Where this nigga Kenny is like the fucking Let's remember, boy. these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They straight from the flock, yeah. Money. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. I don't mean we kill every can't find body. it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well those who choose not to accept our love surely wish that they had. The storm is on the way. All right. Friendship. 50, well, I'm in the middle of 50-50. Took a blame. Serious photo. I blame someone else. Oh, I blame someone. Oh, yeah, I did. I thought I blamed myself. I uh, blame someone else. That's 50-50. Did um, you sit with at a den table? 38% player set with loot. I don't, like I said, I don't fuck with Kenny. So. I told Walter the truth about Matthew. 45%. Uh, it's almost kind of half, too. That's almost half. Nick's fate. You want 42% of the players let Walter make up his own mind. I don't really, like I said, the first time I played that shit, I don't remember that nigga dying like that. I must have told that nigga the truth. Left to find Kenny. Man. You know, he ain't helped much. That nigga getting niggas killed and shit. Little right. He tries. <laughs> he tried too hard to get a W, but <laughs> he looked like a fucking asshole. And then. Yo, you can't skip this shit, dog. Alright, well, I'm done anyway. I'm, I'm done streaming. That's it. Because I'm, I'm about to stop this shit. Like, this shit loud as shit for no reason. All this copyrighted ass music and shit. Oh, I'm done. I swear to God, I don't have enough honey.